Today, in the 21st century, the Earth's food supply is currently facing an ever-growing risk of widespread shortage. Jamaica, the Caribbean, and most small island developing states, SIDS, depend heavily on the food market of the US and other developed countries, and if they run out, all SIDS will be affected. But what if Jamaica becomes the premier food capital of the region? The inventor of the agrodome, Peter Charles Whittington, has envisioned a facility to empower SIDS, like Jamaica, to become the food capital of the region whilst maintaining a strong anchor in the tourism industry. The Agridome is a state-of-art, multi-level, 10-acre indoor farming structure, which produces agricultural crops from each food group on a commercial scale in a climate-controlled environment. The entire facility contains 10 dome structures working in conjunction with each other and relies primarily on renewable energy sources for the growth and subsequent production of each crop. Ideally, the agridome can be located anywhere in the world as the crops it produces are protected from outdoor elements. The Green Ribbon Harvest Team have identified lands located on the central southern section of the island. These areas are mostly flatlands that are currently designated for agricultural development by the government. The project in its totality will ideally require 10,000 acres of land to execute the full vision as the facility will warrant newly developed roads, bridges, and other infrastructural elements such as wind farms, security checkpoints, soil recycling facilities, and water filtration and irrigation facilities. The total 10,000 acres of land will be subdivided into parcels, allowing each dome facility to sit on approximately 200 to 500 acres of land individually. Coastal lands will be the ideal location for the agridome facility as water contains minerals that under the right treatment can be very beneficial to crop growth. In our illustration, we will zoom into a typical subdivision that will house one of the 10 domes. The typical subdivision for each dome facility will feature indoor and outdoor crop farming manufacturing and distribution factory, a soil recycling plant, container loading and logistics area, multiple energy generating systems, and so much more. Housing facilities for facility workers as well as tourist visitors, restaurant and shopping facilities including supermarket and farmers market, agricultural and food preparation school and training facility, protective services such as fire station, police station, hospital and security posts, various crops such as ackees trees, mango trees and so on, fisheries and poultry farm water irrigation systems which is connected to the desalination plant.
So what if Jamaica became the premier food capital of the region? The Agridome could be the answer. Thank you for watching.